Time now for our favorite person of the day when we pick one person who grabbed our attention, eh, not for the right reasons. Today, it is the CEO of Uber, Travis Kalanick, for cashing in on the chaos of a crisis. As Uber customers know, the on-demand car service turns on something called surge pricing during busy days in a particular area. Well, while the police were surrounding a cafe in Sydney, Australia, where a gunman was holding hostages, Uber was raising prices for those trying to flee the area. Prices quadrupled. And it was not done by mistake. Uber actually tweeted, quote, we are all concerned with the events in the central business district. Fares have increased to encourage more drivers to come online and pick up passages in the area. Well, now, shamed, Uber is apologizing and giving refunds to those who paid extra for the rides. And it's not the first time that Uber has used a disaster to price its service higher. During Hurricane Sandy on the East Coast, it did the same thing before being forced to change its policy by New York's Attorney General. Apparently, that policy change was not in effect down under. And so, Travis Kalanick, Uber CEO, is our favorite person of the day. Coming up, more fallout over the Sony hacking scandal. Mike Sargent is here to talk to us about it when a rise exchange comes back.